Hi there. Welcome to our introduction to Synchro Modeler. In this video, we're going to have a quick overview of what Synchro Modeler is about, what it's built for, and what it can do. Now let's look at the current offering structure of Synchro Construction Solutions. As you can see here, Synchro Modeler falls under the 4D package of Synchro. In tandem with Synchro 4D Pro and Modeler, the 4D package is created to enable 4D construction planning and control. So, you might be wondering why we need two separate pieces of software to do this job. Well, to put it simply, 4D Pro is a place where you can set up your 4D schedule and perform model-based progress tracking and cost control. On the other hand, in Modeler, you can prepare your model before you start your work in 4D Pro. If you look at the workflow here, you'll see that we typically start with a design model furnished by the designer and we put it into Modeler to transform it into a construction-ready model. And then we turn to 4D Pro to create the 4D schedule. More specifically, with Modeler, you'll be able to split the model elements based on your chosen means and methods, create work areas, assign cost codes, perform model-based quantity takeoff, and manage design changes. Once you're done with all these tasks, you can switch to 4D Pro, where you'll be able to perform a wide variety of model-based project planning and control. Here, we're going to briefly talk about the main features of Synchro Modeler. First, with Synchro Modeler, you'll be able to slice model elements into smaller pieces based on your chosen means and methods. So why do we need this functionality? Well, for example, imagine you're building a large concrete slab for a bridge. It's unlikely that you'll pour the entire slab without a break. However, most of the design models wouldn't take this into consideration which means you'll need to split the slab according to the way you're going to pour it. There are many ways you can do this in Synchro Modeler, such as creating work areas, slicing model elements by edges or another element, and so on. Furthermore, Synchro Modeler allows you to import your cost code structure and match the cost codes with the model elements based on its properties. You'll be able to assign the right cost code to each model element in a blink of an eye. Modeler is also able to extract geometry information such as volume, area, and length from the model. You can also export the data to Excel to further analyze your data. With this functionality, quantity takeoff will not be as time-consuming and error-prone as it used to be. Lastly, Modeler allows for version comparison, where you'll be able to find the quantity differences between different versions of models. And that's what we call design change management. That's all for our introduction to Synchro Modeler. In the following videos, we're going to show you the step-by-step -step demonstrations and walk you through all the workflows enabled by Synchro Modeler. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.